This is a Crompton's DC potentiometer. Listen, DC Crompton's potentiometer. This is a two volt supply for DC Crompton's potentiometer. And these are coarse and fine serial strikes to adjust the working current uh, while doing standardization. And this is unknown EMF, E1 will be connected here. Unknown EMF will be connected from RPS or any DC source. Okay, next to these are the two rheostats to adjust the voltage level. It has in volts, it is in millivolts. Okay. Now it is the terminal for standard cell connection. Here we are connecting standard cell. The standard cell voltage is 1.018 volts. Next, it is the galvanometer terminals connection, and a galvanometer is connected here. Galvanometer, which type of instrument? Null type instrument, galvanometer. Until it shows null condition, then only it will work. Next, first for for that we have to do for Crompton's potentiometer, we have to do standardization. Standardization will be done with standard cell. After connecting standard cell like this. We are going and changing the function knob into standard STD. STD after moving the terminal into STD, then we are connected standard cell for this. And galvanometer is connected. After that, the supply voltage 2 volts is required for contents potentiometer. We are connected. We are connecting 2 volts. Switch on that DC supply. After connecting two volts DC supply, this is the two volts DC. Now two volts DC supply is connected for Crompton's potentiometer. Okay, after that what we are doing by adjusting these coarse and fine rheostats, we are doing standardization. Now the standard cell is connected, 1.018 volts is connected to standard cell terminals. Now see the galvanometer, galvanometer showing not null condition, it is not indicating null condition. Now by adjusting these two rheostats, we have to do standardization. By adjusting coarse and fine rheostat, we have to do standardization. It is not flying. By adjusting these two rheostats, we have to do standardization. Whether standard cell connected or not. Standard cell terminals. Standard cell terminals are connected and two whole supply is connected. Two volts DC supply is connected to two volts. Standard cell is connected by varying or adjusting these two rheostats, fine and coarse. We are watching galvanometer null condition. After obtaining galvanometer null condition, standardization is over. Now the galvanometer showing null condition after pressing galvano key. After pressing the galvano key here, the galvanometer showing null condition. So now the standardization procedure is over.
how to do standardization by connecting to all supply and by wearing coherent pan rheostat and by connecting standard cell and a galvanometer we are doing standardization of dc compens potentiometer okay now by wearing fires and fine and coherent rheostats we are watching the galvanometer null condition after obtaining the null condition the standardization is over after that we are going for unknown voltage measurement by connecting e1 or e2 any one terminal unknown voltage by wearing these two millivolts and volts knob okay now unknown voltage is connected the unknown voltage now for example we are keeping the unknown voltage as 0.3 unknown voltage we keep now we are doing calibration of this voltmeter 0.3 unknown voltage is connected now standard knob is connected to e1 e1 e2 e2 now standard knob is connected now we can use e1 also okay e1 e1 also we can use by connecting e1 like this by connecting e1 the unknown voltage is connected to e1 now the knob is kept at from standard position to e1 we are keeping the moving after that we are observing the galvanometer condition galvanometer doesn't showing null condition what we have to vary now by adjusting these two knobs now 0.3 indicates we are varying this 0.25 and this knob is varying see the galvanometer now still galvanometer doesn't showing null condition okay, 0.3 is not obtained now by adjusting galvanometer key and it showing on now fine adjustment now we are keeping the unknown voltage source is 0.6 now observing the galvanometer by wearing this and this observe the galvanometer it showing or not galvanometer is done showing zero condition now we have to wear this now the galvanometer showing null condition so now the reading will be 0.5 volts plus 133 volts that is the method of doing calibration of an, an PMMC voltmeter.